well, we're here today with Sue, who is a veterinary cardiologist, um, and she's here to have a look um, at normal shapes and sizes of donkey hearts, so that when we have a sick donkey into the hospital, we know what a normal reference range is, so that we can have a look at them um, and see if they're altered when the donkeys are sick. So it's a non-invasive procedure. The donkeys um, actually quite like it because they get lots of cuddles for a little while, um, and it's it's giving us information that will help them. Um, in the long run. Okay, so what I'm doing is carrying out um, what we call an echocardiogram, which is uh, an ultrasound examination of the heart um, to see how big the chambers of the heart are uh, and to de determine how vigorous the heart is uh, in terms of beating um, and relaxing. What we're looking at here is the main pumping chamber um, for the left ventricle. That's the most powerful chamber in the heart which pushes blood um, into um, this huge artery called the aorta. So in order to take measurements we use a different type of um, image called an M node. And this allows us to take measurements um, so that we can um, see how big the main pumping chamber is when the heart's beating and when it's relaxing. And the aim is to establish a database of measurements of normal donkeys um, so that they can be used as reference when the vets here are examining sick donkeys. Um, uh, they have a, a reference range of normal values uh, of the dimensions of the chambers of the heart. 